Bad day's hunt, lads. Nothing for the pot tonight. And what about young O'Sheen's birthday feast tomorrow? We never should have taken the boy along. He's not been still for five minutes all day. No, he's not ready to ride on a hunt with men yet. <laughs> well, it's late. Better head back, even empty-handed. Fairies have been known to enchant humans passing through these woods at twilight. Fairies? Oh! O'Sheen! 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 Come, O'Sheen. Back, come, come back, back here! Where are you going? Come back! Come back. Arise, fairies, and dance! Follow you, but... You are the only one who can save us now from the evil creatures. The goblins, bogies, and hags. They are threatening us. Come, enter the world of fairy. Sheen, a fearless warrior. Hero? Warrior? But I'm not hero indeed. Instead of a warrior, you've landed a minnow. Pa. A worm. A little chick. We're losing time. <coughs> Come, Oshin. My father, the fairy king, is waiting. A kitten. A nestling. <coughs> a little puppy. Father, we've brought you a mortal, a brave hunter, Oshin. Sir, please, I have to get home before... Mortal? Oh, yes, we need a mortal. The enchanted shadow, you know, is a long story. There was a time, not so long ago, oh, you would have loved it here then, when Fairyland was bright and beautiful. Eternal Spring. Flowers abounded, elfin music was everywhere. Fays sunned themselves on mushrooms. Pixies dreamed of dew and nectar. Our days were long and filled with magic. Magic? Oh yes, my magic was strong then. I even conjured life into my own shadow. (laughs) A feat no sorcerer had ever before accomplished. I had found a new friend, a companion. But sadly, I miscalculated. The shadow's power continued to grow, and mine to fade. The shadow became evil, malevolent with a will of its own. Finally, it escaped, and I was powerless to prevent it. I tried everything, chanted runes, performed strange rites with acorns and moonlight, made a compound, bat's wings, cobwebs, and dragon's breath, all useless. Now, Oshin, the days grow short. 
Nighttime grows longer. Soon the sun's light will not be seen in our land. But the shadow grows stronger, forms alliances with the evil creatures that thrive in the dark corners of Fairyland. But what can I do about it? Oh, you can see how the darkness weakens us fairy folk, saps our strength. But you, you're young. <laughs> a piglet. Strong. A cat. A mortal. A mouse. And you must go out now. Find the shadow. Bring him back. He will never rest until he controls everything that we have had that's good. And the magic, the realm, and especially my beautiful daughter. Oh, no. Yes, I fear Niam will be his next victim. Please, will you accept this challenge and undertake this quest? But... Oh... Oh, all right. I accept the challenge, provided you return me to my home soon after. Splendid. Splendid. You, you've chosen well, Niam. Thank you, Father. An egg. A lamb. Puck will go with you. A little... What? He knows the woods, and his ability to change shape may prove useful. But, but... The shadow strikes tomorrow. There is not a moment to lose. Please go now. Now let all my people come inside the fairy hill. Close all entrances and exits. Let no one remain outside tonight, saving only Oshin and Puck. Tomorrow, we'll see the end of the shadow. All of us. Trees almost look like they're alive. <laughs> Afraid of trees. Send the boy on a man's errand. It's bad if you cook them long enough. <laughs> well, I guess we can start then. I calls for a toast to the shadows of lies, to the goblins, their villainous mouth of lies. May the night hide their deeds. May the sun never rise. <laughs> More evil than him, than folks just has three. <laughs> <laughs> we drink to the shadow, to his cruel hand, and to Squalor Web Castle, where he makes his sand. To the morrow, when you sally forth with his band, to lay waste and wreak havoc and rule. Now what? Must be those trows. Don't let them see me. Rips your prime, but a bit too short to barbecue. How about a cobalt stew? Carrot sponge and a batch of peas. A cup of wine to kill the fleas. Smash mine up if you don't mind, please. My teeth are loose. Hey, that must be a cobalt they've got. How about a cobalt mousse? Yummy. <laughs> 
Now first we slice him up. Slice him up? Yeah. What's the matter with you? Ain't you ever made cold bald ragu before? Lots of times. You bar boils him in beef stock and then you marinate olive oil for 24 hours. I can't wait that long. Oh. I says we saute him in butter. I'll saute you in butter, you great twit. Hey, my Aunt Agnes used to say just to hint the saffron. Your Aunt Agnes, your Aunt Agnes. Who's don't making this dinner anyway? Aunt Agnes. And don't you shout at me, Clyde. I was cooking cold ball before you was had. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, uh, I'm trying to decide whether to add shallots or garlic. Who asked you? You keep on. Garlic. Don't mention that. Name. What is garlic? No, it gives me nightmares. Help. 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 I'm going to help him. A thousand gratitudes. What possible compensation can I provide? Fortuitous presence. What did he say? You don't need to repay us, but please, could you show us the way to Squalor Web Castle? There it is, across the lake. But how can we get to it? Say, Puck, you can change shapes. A great eagle could fly us across. Well, I'll try. <laughs> Not even a sparrow. It must be the shadow. His power is growing, stealing my shape-shifting abilities from me. The trowels brought me in a boat. We can appropriate that for our necessities. What did he say? The Lake of the Fairy Isles. It's beautiful. Well, there are some things here that are not so beautiful, like the marrows. What are they? Great scaly mud. <laughs> well, that's one I owe you. What on earth? It's the unseelie court. They're on patrol for the evil shadow. Run for the trees! That bunch loves human flesh! <laughs> It's me they're after. Aye, that they are, lad. And they'll come inside where it's safe. Who are you? Who are you, is it? And isn't it meself should be asking the questions with a lot of you hiding out on me front porch? But... But, but, but. Now just be stepping over here into me parlor and we'll have a bit of sit down and a chit chat. In you come, then. In you come. Well, now, I'll tell you who I am, me fine young mortal. They calls me the Fair Derrick. And it's pleased I am to meet your acquaintance. This here is me house, so make yourselves at home. Now then, maybe you'll be telling me what you're doing, what about these woods on a night like this instead of staying home in your warm beds at all at all. Well... But first a glass of elderberry wine to take the night's chill out of your bones. And you must try a bite of me homemade primrose pie. I'll just pop into the kitchen while you makes yourself comfortable by the fire. As for myself, I do like a slice of hazelnut bread spread with rowanberry jelly. Get back up there, you greedy overgrown shillelagh. You'll have to excuse me, three lads. It ain't used to company. What did you say you was doing out there? We're going to Squalor Web Castle to get the sh- Are you indeed, then? Why, you've only to wait till tomorrow, me buckos, and he'll be after coming out by himself, that he will. Here, have a spot of foxglove pudding. I just made it this morning. Now, why don't you just spend the night here by the fire and forget this foolishness? Well, you might have something there. Maybe just a few hours of sleep. <sighs> No, Puck, don't fall asleep. We've got to find the shadow before he comes out. Why, you'll never scramble the Black Belly Mountain in the dark. And how are you going to get past the red caps? Old Shadow uses them for guards. They keep their caps nice and red, don't you know, by deepening them in blood. Where do these stairs go? Why, bless you, my boy. They just goes down to an old abandoned gold mine I use for a root cellar. There's old mine shafts all over these parts. 
that's right. They even say there's one that leads into Squalor Web Castle. Hey, maybe this is it. Let's find out. Uh, uh, you two go ahead. <laughs> I just remembered some important business that I have to attend to. <laughs> oh, no. The only important business you have is to guide us through this mine. We need you. Now, are you sure you wouldn't like to stay for a nice cup of wild thyme tea? If this leads to the castle, I'll be a cross-eyed spriggan. We've been wandering around this mine for hours. Uh, we, we should be under Black Valley Mountain by this time. <gasps> ah! Shh! It's just rats. They're more afraid of you than you are of them. Uh, I, I, I doubt it. They have beady eyes and sharp t -t teeth. Uh, look! What's that? An old mine cage. Let's try it. It looks pretty rickety to me. Well, there seems to be no other choice. Let's go. you, Puck. I'll need your help. Everyone's depending on us. What's that you say? You saw a mortal and you let him get away? How dare you? I shall smother you all for this. I want that mortal now. Bring him to me unless you want to be boiled in oil. Go! Where he is. Puck, come on. I don't think I want to see what's on the other side of that door. Don't be silly, Puck. It's only a shadow. Who intrudes upon my perfect darkness? <gasps> well, well, what have we here? Why, it's you, we punk, and that brave mortal. <laughs> You're coming with us, back to the king where you belong. Oh, my, you are so fierce. More reason for me to pulverize you. First you two, and then all of Fairyland. Tomorrow, I will plunge all Fairyland into my awesome darkness. No more of your sweet pixies, charming fays, or despicable little chameleons like you, Pat. However, Niam, that vision of beauty, will survive, and she will be mine. That light! Put it out! Look, her shadow is as big as he is. <laughs> now, Shadow, this is more like an even fight. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 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 
it if that candle goes out. You're through, Oshin. But I was a shadow before, and I'll be a shadow still. <laughs> that door in time to save you. The mortal is winning! <laughs> Gone. He's disappeared. Did he escape? No, he's done for. Look, it's the sun. The night is over. The shadow's power is finished. I can feel my powers returning. Let's get out of here. This is my chance to save your life. Well done, brave O'Sheen. And you too, Puck, and Kobold. Welcome back, all. As you can see, the rebel has returned, and all my old powers are back. I proclaim a celebration. Let there be food. Music. And dancing. Let every give thanks to young O'Sheen and his friends for this great task they have accomplished. I wish I could remain in Fairyland and live amidst the happiness that you share. But I must return to my own world. So let it be. We will miss you. And I'll miss you. Puck, I... Stay away from twisted trees. Yes, and, and always keep an extra supply of candles. Oshin! Oshin, come back here! Oshin, why didn't you come when we called for you? It's bad enough that we didn't have anything for your so-called manhood feast. After all, good heavens! Look at that game! What a feast we'll have tomorrow! How could you possibly have caught all that? You've only been out of our sight for a few minutes. Well, you see, that is... Well, it all started when this Never dear... mind, lad. You've made the day. What a hunter you've turned out to be. Come on, let's be getting back. <laughs> 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 